So in the last video, I just showed you how to go live to Facebook. Uh, what about when we want to schedule it and uh, plan it in advance, give people notice, give them a link to go to? That's what we're going to do now. So my window's looking the same as it did in the last video. The only difference is instead of go live now, we're going to say new schedule live. And this time we are going to use a title. Now I do weekly support calls into my groups. Uh, so that would be a title that I would use. Um, keeping this quite simple for now. So a title, a description. Remember I said in that last video that you can change the description afterwards. We can just put a date in. So I'm gonna put this in for tomorrow, 31st. And um, let's go 5 p.m. here in the UK. It will take the time where you live. And again, it does just show you there. Uh, you can schedule between 10 minutes in the future and seven days. Now, uh, do put an image in here because this is gonna go up onto your page or your group on the feed and uh, yeah, it won't look pretty with just the default one that it drops in. You need to create an image to go in here. Now, uh, if you don't have one, let me just quickly show you. We use Snapper. I've put a link in the description to it. Uh, we prefer this one over Canva. Yes, it's one that we pay for, but uh, there's a lot of great features in it. Now, we would come down here to YouTube thumbnail. And uh, you can just start from scratch. So maybe I want to simply put a background color in this. And then text and change the color of that text to one that can be seen. I can just stretch this out. So it can be as simple as this. You could jazz it up a bit. You could add some graphics in there if you wanted. Maybe I want to drop one of these in. Okay. And I can save that. In this case, I'm just going to quickly download it. It's purely for this demo. Now I've got that image here. So I click it up here for my thumbnail image. And uh, here's one that's just come down then. Hit on open. The importance is that you're getting it to the 16 by 9 size, which is why in Snapper, we select that YouTube format, which gives me a 1280 by 720 image. So we can see it's in there. And I can now hit schedule. And that's going to appear in the group at 5 p.m. There it goes. Now, if I want to go over to that, I can hit up here and say view post on Facebook and it's taken me to the group and there you go. That's my image that comes in. So it says, please join me for the weekly live. So note that we put a title and a description. So this is where the title comes in and this is the description. And it means that I can get a reminder or somebody else can get a reminder, which means 15 minutes before you're gonna get a notification saying, Adrian's about to go live. And if I want to maybe leave a question in here as well, it means that my members can have a look at it. And maybe this happens for me all the time. You know, can we discuss this? I had this issue come up and then it gives me some uh, thoughts in advance to have a look at. And then when we get onto the live, I can see all that come through. Now, frustratingly, the way Facebook works, this won't actually be the post where your live appears. Your live will appear in the group, but the link will be in this post to go to it. You'll see what I mean when you get in there. Um, but yeah, I would always prefer to do this and schedule it in advance. Uh, other people choose just to go live at a set time into the group totally up to them. I just like the fact that I can now send an email out to people. And if I want to know where this uh, post is, I can come back into Ecamm. And when I say view the post on Facebook, that address at the top there is the one that I would put into an email to say, hey, here's a reminder that tomorrow's the support call. Alternatively, where it's got two minutes in this case, there's a little hyperlink underneath your name that will either say just now or it might say in the last five minutes or however long it's been. I can right click on that and I can say copy link address. That again will give me the link that I can then post. So several ways of doing that um, and thoughts really as to why I would schedule rather than just go live. Okay, so by all means, let me know in the comments, are you gonna schedule or are you just gonna go live? Why might you prefer one over the other? Um, always interested to hear from you, but I hope you found that useful. As ever, please give us a thumbs up and subscribe, hit the notification because we've got stacks of Ecamm videos coming your way. I'll see you in another one.